Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to crochet this cowl and the hat. It's a set. with ruffles and the hat for this project I'm going to use a red hard comfort it's 100% acrylic and uh, it says it's medium weight yarn 4.5 millimeter hook or 5.5 millimeter hook so i'm going to use five and six five i'm going to use for the brim and for the rest of the hat six it has Eight hundred sixty seven yards or seven hundred ninety two meters, four hundred fifty four grams. I'm using this color. So let's get started. I'm going to chain sixty eight. And using five millimeter hook inch. Sixty eight. I changed sixty eight. Now I'm going to join with slip stitch in the first chain. Chain three and double crochet in the next stitch and all the remaining stitches. Finish the round with a double crochet. The end of the first round. Last one. Join with the last chain of the first half double crochet. Now chain two. Next stitch is going to be front post double crochet. Next one, back post double crochet. So this round and the next three rounds are going to be front post and back post double crochet. So this is going to be the ribbing. So with this round, you're going to have five rounds. This one, the first one, second, and three more with first with the front post double crochet and back post double crochet. Mm -hmm. 
the end of the row two, round two. The last stitch. Join with slip stitch. Chain two. Now next three rounds are going to be same front post and back post double crochet and after the third round so one two three and two more after this one uh, the ribbon is going to be done so just work with front post and back post double crochet the end of round five now chain one so one two three four five five rounds Two and a half inches. And this is stretchy, so I'm going to measure it. Ten inches. Now we are going to change the hook, size 6, 6 millimeter hook, I already chained one, we're going to work with single crochet and we are going to add 10 more stitches in this round. We're going to work single crochet but instead of grab in the yarn like this I'm going to grab the yarn the hook over the yarn no like this no go like this over the yarn So we are going to add 10 more stitches in this round. One, two, three, four, five, six. So the first chain, you can count the first chain. One, two, three, four, five, six. In the six, one more single crochet next in the seventh one more single crochet one two three four five six seven one more in the same stitch so we're going to continue now in the sixth next in the seventh six in the six one more stitch in the seventh next time one more stitch so that's going to be to be even ten more stitches so here I have six here is the uh, the sixth stitch two one two three four five six this is the seventh two now six one two 
थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स वन मोर सिंगल क्रोशे इन द सेम स्टेच नाउ सेवन सिंगल क्रोशे इन द सेवन वन मोर वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन वन मोर कंटिन्यू द राउंड एड इन सिंगल stitches in the seven in the sixth and seventh stitch the end of the first round of single stitches so here i have two one one and now i'm going to join the slip stitch chain one we are not going to add any more stitches we're going to continue with this number of stitches and single stitch chain one in the same stitch single crochet now just single crochet all the way around just remember this one the hook over the yarn grab the yarn and make single crochet the end of the round two slip stitch chain one single crochet in the same chain in the same stitch We're going to continue working in a single stitch in one, two, three, um, fifteen or fourteen more rounds. So in total, seventeen rounds in single stitch. This is how it's going to look like. So work 14 more rounds in single stitch and I'll meet you there. Then we're going to start decreasing. Finishing the row 17. stitch and join let's count the rounds one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen It looks like small X's.
when you come to this point if you want this part longer you can add more rows now don't finish with 17 you can make two three four as long as you want and if you want wider this part to be wider here in the first row when i added 10 stitches you can add more stitches if you want it wider if you want it longer here you can add now after 17 rows as as many row, rows as you, as you want now i'm going to start decreasing chain one this counts as a is a stitch one two one two three four five make five skip the next one go to the this one again one two three four five skip this one this is the next one stitch skip this one go to the next one one two three four five skip this one go to this one one two three four five skip next one go to the next one continue doing this till you finish the round the end of the first decreasing round so i just skipped one here one two three one two three four five now is the last stitch we're going to skip this and join in the first stitch chain one one now we are not decreasing in this round just a single stitch all across without decreasing finish the round without decreasing the end of the round join with slip stitch chain one now we are going to decrease in this round one two three four skip next one go to the next one one two three four skip next one this one go to the this one one two three four skip this one go to this one continue doing this make for single crochet skip one 
Make four single crochets, skip one. Continue till the end of the round. At the end of the round, one, two, three, four. We skip this one. One, two, three, four. We're going to skip this one. I'm going to join the round with slip stitch, chain one, make one single crochet and in each of the remaining stitches without decreasing. So we're going to decrease one round, the next round we are not decreasing. So continue working the round without decreasing. I'm at the end of the round. Slip stitch. Chain one. One. Two. Three. Skip the next one. Go to the next one. One. Two, three. Skip this one. Go to this one. One, two, three. Skip one. This one. Go to this one. One, two, three. Skip one, go to the next one. One, two, three. Skip one, go to the next one. Finish the row doing this. One, two, three. Skip one. One, two, three, skip the last one and join this slip stitch, chain one, single stitch all around without decreasing. the end of the round and this is going to be the last round the last round for the hat now we are going to start this Ruffle. Let's say ruffle, it looks like a flower. In the chain two, in each stitch, three double crochets. One. Two, three, one, two, three. Next stitch. One. Two, 
pretty. So in every single crochet, make three double crochet. It already started to look like a raffle. the round making three double crochets in each single crochet one two three two more stitches one Two, three, one, two, three. Join with slip stitch. Chain two. Chain two. We are going to make two more rounds with double crochet. Double crochet in each double crochet. We're not adding any more. Finish this round and one more round after this. Just double cro crochet in each double crochet and I'll meet you there. At the end of the round three, chain with slip stitch and cut the yarn. So one, two, three, three rounds with uh, double crochet. Now break a piece of yarn, grab the needle, Now we are going, let's find where the, here is where we started the row and ended. Under, over, and over, under.
you're going through with this uh, yarn in the last round of the single stitch. Here, where we started, remove the needle, gather this part as tight as you can. You see this part is closed, should not be open. Now go in this side. Make a knot. Another knot. As tight as you can. Go again in the other side. Again two knots. Maybe one more time. Now we are going to hide this yarn. inside the needle Do the same with this one.
And the hat is done. This is the back. You can notice this. Now we are going to fix this a little bit. you can see it's pretty Now I started the cowl, chain 29. For the cowl, I started here. And working this, going one around, one row. In this side, turn the work, work in the other side. Uh, you can start from here if you want to, but you can work in circle if you start here, just like I uh, did with hat. But I, because I worked this first one like this, I'm going to work and this one just like I did with this one. So chain 29, second uh, single crochet in the second chain from the hook and the, the all the remaining chains, single crochet, just like we did with the hat with the hook over the yarn. The end of the first row. Chain one. Turn the work. Chain one. Work in this space. The cowl is going to be all in single crochet, except one round we're going to make the ruffle, only one round.
the end of the row two. Work on this one, don't forget. Chain one, turn, single crochet all the way across. Chain one, turn. You're going to look like this, like ridges. If you turn it like this, you can see these ridges. Chain one, turn. Continue doing this. Work even until the work reaches nineteen inches. You can see it. Only single crochet in each row. 19 inches. And I'll meet you there. At the end of the last row, So I'm going to measure it now. Nineteen inches. Is long 19 inches and wide 9.5 inches. Now we are going to sew these two together. It's, it looks same in both sides, in both sides, so it doesn't matter. The first stitch with the first stitch.
grab both loops. Turn it in the right size side. Now chain two. In this first stitch. We're going to make four double crochet. So in one row we're going to make four double crochets, next row three double crochet. Now we're making three. Two. Three. In this row four, next one three, four, three, four, three. Three, now four. One, two. Three, four, and this one, three, one, two, three, next one, four, one, Two, three, four. So we are making the raffles. I'm going to make only one round, just like I did in this one. Here is only one round. If you want, you can make two, but. I think this is enough. Four, now three. One, two, three. Next one, four. One, Two, three, 
Cool. Continue working in one row three double crochets in the next one four. So three four three four three four till the end of the round. I'll meet you there. At the end of the round, so in last one I had four. Now three one two three in this one four one two three four Next one, three, one, two, three. In this one, I'm going to make three. I have one from the beginning when I started the round. Here are four, this is extra, so three and one four. One, two, three. Join with slip stitch and finish. So this is what left from that big ball. I think you need probably 250 grams of yarn because this big ball I don't know exactly but 250 it might be enough. Now I'm going to hide this yarn And it's done.
the hat and the cowl. I hope you and you like the video and if you're new to my channel please su subscribe and I will see you next time have a good day bye